Hi guys, 18 Dapper here. Quick intro to the video. On the 28th of July, myself, Vicky and some work colleagues are doing a sponsored skydive for Bluebell Woods Children's Hospice. Link will be in the description down below. If you can donate anything, it would be greatly appreciated. Let's get on with today's video. You alright guys, 18 Dapper, fitness. So, we're doing a fitness vlog again this week. I had last week off, didn't feel very well at all, all week. So, went to work, came home absolutely exhausted and just went to bed most days. Um, but feeling much better this week, so plan is Monday, run, Wednesday, Friday and then a run at the weekend. So, four runs this week because the wildlife, 5k, got last year's shirt on. That's three weeks away. So need to put some work in to get that sub 5k, uh, sub 30 minutes 5k. Today, gonna probably do a guided run on the Night Plus running app. Uh, just need to find out which one. So gonna get ready, find a run that I wanna do today, and then uh, go and do it. So let's see how we get on. Today's run is done and the one which I decided to do was Kevin we gotta go and it was a 25 minute run a uh, recovery run but with a warm up and a cool down so ended up doing 3.13 miles real steady run 11.09 per mile so 35 minutes all together so Looking at that, that was a really steady run. Felt like I could give a bit more. I wouldn't say a lot more. Uh, it's going to be close. I've got three big weeks coming up to train for the 5K if I want to get sub 30 minutes, which that's the aim. Always has been the aim, always will be. If I don't get it, I'll be disappointed, but I don't think it'll be a failure because I've got out there applied to do a 5k and trained for it so if I didn't ever if I didn't signed up for that then potentially I'd still be where I was when you guys first saw me at nearly 17 stone and looking out of shape so plan this week three more runs I'm gonna go for a run on Wednesday Friday and then one at the weekend unless I feel decent on Thursday then I might get them all in in the week um, and potentially go to the football Saturday away at MK Dons we will see how the week pans out but the next run definitely on Wednesday um, do another guided run I enjoy the guided runs on the night running app uh, they're a little bit like a podcast but with a bit of music as well so I do enjoy those while I'm out on my own running around the streets so on to Wednesday and hopefully probably do the same route um, same route similar guided run times and then hopefully we'll see that time or the distance reduce a little bit because I had quite a long walk home today after that guided run and finish so hopefully the walk home is less and less each time we do it yeah guys this week not gone to plan at the start of this vlog said that I wanted to do three runs during the week Monday Wednesday Friday but it has been an absolute killer at work very very busy productions increasing so been working really hard throughout the day and been working extra hours as well it's all excuses I know but we've been getting home having dinner and just crashing but we're at the weekend now Saturday Sunday gonna uh, gonna save this week and we're going for a run. Vicky's joining me today. We're going to go around the lake. Um, I'm going to do a speed run. Try and get this speed work up a little bit. And then we'll go for another run tomorrow. So at least we'll get three runs in this week. Monday, Saturday, Sunday. And then put a bit more effort in next week. Because then Wildlife 5k is two weeks away. And as always the aim is sub 30 sub 30, got to get that in my head and when it gets to race day 
got to dig deep because I think I'm going to struggle getting it but I've set myself a target I want to try my best to achieve it so I'm going to go on a run now um, when you next see me we'll go through the splits and I'll let you know how I've done today's run is done did a speed workout hopefully you can see this not sure if you can I can't can't see because of the light but totally through it it was run strong repeat it was a, a guided run and managed to do 1.96 miles in 20 minutes and that's average pace of 10 12 tough run um, 10 intervals 8 at 5k pace which they say is an 8 out of 10 effort it's difficult finding that pacing um, when you're not used to running and then two uh, two intervals at one mile pace that was interval 5 and 10 uh, a good bit of the coaching was the arms arms are important I never realised that how important arms can be to get your rhythm uh, and towards the end that really helped uh, but yeah tough one I feel it um, but 10 12 I think there's a little bit more that I could give um, definitely I mean I, I don't know if that's taking into account the uh, the 45 second rests I don't think it is I think that's just the running but it's getting closer to the 5k a bit more work another run tomorrow don't know where Vicky is but we'll ask her how her run was when she gets back Vicky's back how was your run? <sighs> bit tough but I enjoyed it good I think I pushed myself I did 5.2k in 35 minutes and 41 seconds so, so if I continue to train the last time we did the 5k at the Yorkshire Wildlife Park I did it in 33 minutes so I'm hoping to get bang on 30 minutes this time so Vicky's aiming for 30 minutes I'm aiming for under 30 minutes let's see how we do eh? but that's using Vicky's Fitbit, she's timed it on that as well. So it's difficult with running technology. I don't know how accurate the phone is, how accurate Fitbit is. Um, so the run that we're doing is chip timed. As soon as you go over the start line, your time begins. And then as soon as you go over the finish line, your time ends. So we'll be timing it on as phones or as Fitbits, but until we get the official timing on the day, we won't know, will we? No, but I went round the lake twice. I didn't round the lake twice about 3k. Yeah, I think... Uh, I, 5k. Yeah. Yeah, the lake The lake at Donny, I'm sure it's 2.5k once around, so two laps of the lake, it's 5k. So, right, we'll be on a run tomorrow. Same route. Yeah, might as well. Yeah, so we'll be back down around the lake tomorrow morning. Um, and hopefully improve on these times I think I'll just do a basic run rather than a speed run because that killed me I'm dripping Vic is dripping there we go news just in <laughs> see you tomorrow Morning. run today twice round the lake that's the plan I'm feeling a little bit tender after yesterday how are you feeling Vic? what after yesterday's run or do you mean yesterday's alcohol? <laughs> We had a run yesterday, but then we went out drinking. I had a Saturday drinking session, didn't we? An unplanned. Unplanned drinking <laughs> session. We went into town, did a bit of shopping. And then while we were there, we said, shall we go and have one? And it turned into seven, eight. <laughs> yeah, it turned into a fair few. So woke up this morning with a bit of a sore head. Done the food shop, so we're gonna have a bite to eat, get a bit of energy and then a nice steady two laps around the lake so when you next see me we'll go through the splits see how we've done today was an absolute killer I blame I blame drinking yesterday I just felt all the ale coming out of me but good news I did once around the lake I know I wanted to do two but after at first, coming towards the end of the first lap, I was struggling. 
Um, we'll show you the splits. We finally got a map. Look at that. Yay. I don't know why it's taken so long to do or to, to start tracking again. But hopefully this is the start of it tracking all the time. So 1.78 miles. And I did 1.78 miles. Are you ready? Mini celebration. 9.37 a mile. So based on that, a sub 30 for the 5k is on. I just need to work hard over this next two weeks and hopefully get the fitness to be able to sustain that for 3.1 miles which I should oh. if you've enjoyed this week's vlog I'm glad to be back on it felt shocking last week so I think a week's rest has done me good helped me recover from being well it, it was man flu um, but I feel refreshed and I feel motivated again to uh, to achieve this sub 30 for the 5k so if you have enjoyed this week big thumbs up for us please subscribe if you haven't already thank you if you have subscribed the channel's growing quicker than I ever thought it would um, and comments in the section down below enjoy reading them enjoy replying to them I'll see you next week.